What's up, PC boy gang, and welcome to Farming Simulator 22. It has been quite some time since I've actually played in here. So what I'm going to be doing in this video is just going over how I set up um, a pregame. Like if I'm starting like a um, Let's Play series or whatever, which I'm going to be starting. So this is basically how I'm going, I'm going to have it set up. I'm going to choose Portugal South. Um, it has the look and feel that I need. I did add several um, mods in here. You can see some auto loading stuff, some cell points, and all of that kind of stuff. So, we're going to be using those. So, let's get this loaded up and um, kind of walk through what I'm going to be doing to get this set up for the Let's Play series. Um, basically, we started on um, the hardest mode there is. Um, we don't own any land or anything, but we do own a bunch of equipment on this specific map. I'm going to be selling most of that equipment because I think it's kind of a cheat, I guess. And then I'm going to save the game, load out of the map, and see if there is... Which I know they have. There is a... Um, a tax sign that you can use and that will actually remove some of the money because I don't want to start with the full money. All right, I'm just going to go with that character there. All right, so for what I'm thinking about, let's take a quick look here. We start with all of these things here. Actually, in medium tractor, you have two. Several of these, you have several options. I'm going to go ahead and get rid of most of these, like I said before. So let's sell that tractor right there. Uh, I think I'm going to get rid of all of the harvesters. Um, kind of have an idea of how I'm going to start the Let's Play. Not going to give away too much on that beforehand. But I'm going to go ahead and get rid of all of these things in here. With the exception of the two tractors. The, the small one and the medium one. All right, so all equipment sold except for those two tractors. Um, I still have not decided on uh, which farmland to start with. I really think that's the one it's probably going to be because it has all of those there. But I think the biggest problem for me is that there's a cutoff between here. Um, and it is close to everything else, like, you know, and that's, that's, that's good, but at the same time, do I want that? 17, it's 250. Does this have road access? Seems like it. What's been grown in there? Canola and it has <clears throat> that might be an option. Let me actually I'm right across the street from it, so I could actually go look. Problem is does this road does this land have um road access is is my biggest question. Let's see, let's come all the way down here. Yep, there is there is road access. So it would be this piece of land here. Make this smaller. <clears throat> and then these two that already has crops in there. So I think that's what I'm gonna go with. I think I'm gonna go ahead and purchase this farmland here. All right, so now we own that, right? Let's go into the construction menu and let's see what we want to place. Let's do farmhouses first. I actually like this one right here. I mean, it's small. Wait. Why is it saying I don't own the land? I'm just saying it's overlapping, okay. What? Can I 
Can I put like fences up? Oh. Okay. Right on the road that this thing is on. Let's see. Alright, so what I'm going to do is just remove that much of it. Um, and then I'm going to place the... Cat, man. I'm going to use the farmhouse. <clears throat> this is a mobile one. I think this might be... Actually... I think I might use the cabin one. Let's see. I am probably going to place it somewhere here. Can I rotate this? Maybe put the back of it towards the fence over here. Maybe somewhere here. That's good. That is where I want it. That's fine. All right, so we're going to have some work to do to get this farm cleaned up to where we need it for the Let's Play series. But for now, um, the trees are going to get cleaned off. I'll probably do that in a Let's Play series. With that said, there's there's going to be a need to reduce some of the money I have. Um, let me actually go and put in like a small shed or something. So there are no really small sheds in here. Maybe it's actually kind of big, but okay. That's bigger than my house. Let's not put a shed. Let's just leave that as is. Okay. <clears throat> so for us to reduce the money, the best thing to do is lease um, the most expensive equipment repeatedly. So let's go ahead and do that. Let's go to... Vehicles and let's do. I want to say maybe one of these are expensive. All right, as you can see, we actually um brought the money down to one hundred and six thousand, and I think that's where we're gonna leave it. Um, basically, in the what we're what's gonna happen is I'm gonna follow up this video with a um a let's play series. I've done quite a few of those and not complete any of them uh, i think this is going to be well i know this is going to be a turning point for that i'm gonna just i'm just gonna play it and see what happens but yeah we ended up renting out um one of the most expensive equipments repeatedly until we got down to 106 000. and i think that's where we're gonna leave it so if you guys did like the video please go ahead and hit the like button if you want to stay up to date what's going on please go ahead and subscribe guys want to be notified every time i post that video hit the bell beside the subscribe button if you have any tips comments suggestions please leave them below and look out for some more mod videos coming out i'm going to start doing the reviews on, on um certain mods again maybe once or twice a week depending on if there's anything i like and i'll most likely be using quite a few of those mods i review in my um let's play series so again thank you guys for watching